Hey, what's good all? How's it going? And welcome back to my latest unboxing. And of course, at the end of this video, I will finally announce that giveaway winner. I want to apologize. This was two days ago, but things just came up. Work, life, it is what it is. It happens. Uh, not feeling good. Stuff like that. So I do have the winner at the end of this video, so stay tuned. Uh, but before we dive in, let's check out this month's Loot Crate. What? Yes, it's two days late, eh, whatever, uh, but yeah, we'll see, I know I've, uh, I'm sure people have already seen what's in it, so, but I'm still going to show it off, let's uh, check out the goodness, I've heard good and bad things, last month, very questionable, because I guess last month was a lot of people got different things and stuff like that, which just doesn't make sense, so I don't know what they're doing, not sure. All right, first up, we have a t-shirt, of course. And the t-shirt is, let's see. Okay, some Rick and Morty loot wear. So that's Rick with his brain with all the different characters on it. You can see in the brain, which if you have not watched Rick and Morty, which as you can see, I'm wearing a Rick and Morty shirt, which is kind of funny. That's pretty sick. Now the white, eh. I don't know about it, but let's uh, see what it looks like on. And there you go. Just like the magic of the camera. I, you know what? It's not bad. It's okay. I mean, it's Rick and Morty. It's cool. But I got to say, it's not... Their quality is kind of... It's not as soft. I'm kind of a little disappointed, Luke Crate. What the hell? What's going on here? It's definitely not a soft, so. All right, next up we have a, another loot wear type item in here, and that's some Harry Potter socks. I mean, you can see all different, uh, just different symbols, I guess you would call them, from Harry Potter, so. I, I won't complain. I could always use some more. Well, I don't know if I really need more socks. The girlfriend would say otherwise, but I'll take more socks. I won't complain. I'll take them. So that works for me. And let's see. Let's move on to this month's pin, which it looks like... Oh, it's from Westworld. Okay, which Westworld was a good movie. I really did like Westworld, if you can see it. Good movie, good show from HBO. I caught it when they did a free preview. I watched through it pretty quick. Um, I enjoyed it. I read, definitely enjoyed it. This shirt's a little itchy. Mm, I don't like it. Uh, maybe washing it might change it, but yeah. Mm, whatever. Uh, Westworld, good show, definitely. If you haven't watched it and you got HBO, you need to watch it. Uh, in my opinion, one of the better shows on there. I'm not a Game of Thrones fan, so I'm not going to talk trash, but as if you know, I just don't like the show. So, But Westworld, enjoyed it. Highly recommend it. Very enjoyable. Next up we have The X-Files. Circle of Truth. Never seen X-Files. Never really just... It wasn't something that was my cup of tea. Even though I do like paranormal... Some paranormal stuff and everything. Oh. It looks like it's... A bunch of cards. I'm not going to open it up because I'll probably give it away. But it's a bunch of cards of different characters and stuff like that. And it's like a ID card holder. So, eh. 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 Nothing. Nothing for me. Not, not my thing. Not my thing at all. Um, yeah, the X-Files thing that comes in it. Oh, it's a game. Okay, it's a game. Um, I'm not going to open up either because, yeah, it's a game that I definitely will not jump into. I will tell you that right now. There is no way in hell I'm jumping into this. Uh, it says game designed right on the back, as you can see. So, cool. Well, not really cool. And then the final item is another Westworld item. And this is like that Stranger Things, which I have not built the Stranger Things yet, and I'm not going to build this yet, because when you see my video, which hopefully will be out within the next week or so on my office once I finish the final items, um, I'm just kind of out of room, so I don't know where I'll do it. Uh, this is for Dolores and Arnold, which were two of the two of my uh, very some of the favorite characters in there. Um, it's called Super Emo Friends. Uh, Jay Salvador has been pulling 
on Heartstrings with his Super Emo Friends line of art since 2009. Ooh, Loot Crate has partnered with Salvador to create exclusive figural renditions of his drawings and painting Super Emo scenes. Drawings inspirations from a pivotal scene in Season 1 of Westworld, Dolores and Arnold, are recreated here, maintaining the heavy emotion of the moment. Huh. It's a adult collectible, not a toy. 17 plus. One figure, one base, one wall. So, it's cool. I like it. I, if I find room, I definitely will build it. You know, these are cool things. Uh, being a Loot Crate exclusive, I guess you consider it. Call it it is. So, And then the Loot Checklist. So, this month was Discover. We discovered Westworld, X-Files, Harry Potter, Rick and Morty. I don't... Hmm, whatever. Um... So, and it shows all the different items there. You get a exclusive item with the loot pin, which I don't know because they don't provide the books in here anymore, which is, I don't know, they're getting cheap. I, this is an okay box. At the rate loot crate's going, though, I don't know how much longer I'll stick it up. Uh, stick, stick it up. Stick with it. We'll find out. But I did subscribe to two new boxes that are coming out. Um... I'm curious. I'm going to let you wait and see what they are when they finally get here. I did get a mystery gift from one of them that is being sent right away. The next won't be till sometime next month. And then also, I did subscribe to the Toonami box from Cartoon Network. Uh, I got to say, I subscribed months ago and still haven't received it. It was supposed to finally come out last month. I've seen people get it this month. I don't know what the hell's going on. They haven't sent it. I've emailed no response, and it's really starting to get annoying. So if you guys know anything about that box or have known anyone that has subscribed and a way to figure out what the hell's going on, please let me know because it's starting to piss me off. Uh, it was $50, and it's $50 wasted now. Uh, I was kind of excited for it because Cartoon Network, Toonami, the next one's going to move into Adult Swim, uh, I believe. And then after that, I think, was... Robot Chicken one, I think, something like that. So, or something like that. So, I don't know. Uh, which Rick and Morty's, maybe get some cool items for Rick and Morty, but I haven't received it, so who the hell knows? So, let me know. Other than that, please hit that like and subscribe down below. But, of course, before I dive into that, the winner of the game, The Marvelous Mistake, uh, as you can see, is Serena falcon so congrats so you can always send me a message on the back end of this channel you can send me a dm on twitter we've got facebook however you want uh and let me know um because then i can send you the code because obviously i don't want to do it right on here because someone you know is going to be an ass hat ass hat yes i said ass hat and i did it right as i stood at the hat um and steal it so Without further ado, like I said before, hit that like and subscribe down below. Also, if you want, check me out on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. I am, you know, popping off some more pictures on Instagram. I might throw some teasers or something. Who knows? I'm always thinking of stuff. I don't always follow through because time-wise, I sidetracked all that, get busy. Um, and then my video for my room, like I said, is coming out within a week or so, hopefully, uh, for the new setup. So please tune in for that. As always, though, please don't forget to unleash your inner nerd, and I will see you next unboxing. Peace.